beauty is skin deep. When you see people with albinism or anyone that's different, I think it's important for people to go deeper than what's on the surface. Deandra Forrest is a model, actress, and activist. Growing up in a largely Latino and African-American neighborhood in the Bronx, she often felt like what she described as being a black girl in a white girl's body. I had neighborhood friends who asked my older brother if I was adopted. There were lots of times where I felt um, different. In school, even just on the train, there would be parents, adults, you know, who, who stared at us and laughed at us. But Deandra's parents were very supportive and gave her all the strength she needed to believe in herself. At the age of 14, she knew she wanted to be a model. And sure enough, a few years later, Deandra became the first person with albinism to sign up with a major modeling agency. In the modeling industry, we're looked at as something that's um, maybe extraterrestrial, an odd beauty, not just, you know, like a regular beauty, whatever that is. Well, here, the, um, the ratio is, um, one to 20,000, mm -hmm. and in Tanzania, it's one to 1,400. Really? 1,400? 1,400. Wow. Deandra has become an activist, both to demystify her condition and support those who are worst affected. She takes an active role in numerous campaigns, including a UN initiative for albinism awareness. The Colorful Campaign provides scholarships and safe houses for people who are in real danger. Deandra is one of its frontline ambassadors, and she's also behind the Beyond My Skin Campaign, a photography exhibition, and an inspiring collection of live stories of people with albinism. I would like for us to maybe have some sort of big brother, big sister program to mentor younger children that have albinism, for us to help parents that have children with albinism understand more what it is and how it can affect us. Although a lot has changed since getting teased in the schoolyard, one thing hasn't. Deandra still lives in New York City, only this time with her colorful, growing family. She takes her place in a community of activists who are changing the way people view albinism and helping the world find the beauty in every possible shade of color.